Hey, what's up, YouTube fam? I got the update that everybody's been wanting me to do on the TV set. Now, keep in mind that I did have the previous update before the this latest one here, and I'll have the exact update in the uh, the description. But um, I had the actual 950H and the Z9G update of uh, I think it came out like three months ago, two months ago, something like that, and uh, I believe it's close to the same thing as the Z9F um, update, maybe a couple things different, who knows. But I know for sure that the actual platform, the actual Android platform is going to be pretty much the same. So I, I did it anyway. I downloaded it anyway. I don't, see, I don't think I'm going to see much difference. But uh, I'm doing the update right now and we're going to be able to see if there is going to be any difference on the update. So. Okay, once you get to the privacy policy uh, mode, after the, uh, the TV takes the update, you will see this agreement here on the right side that they're trying to get you to agree to all. Um, so, Sony Smart TV Services, Program Recommendations and Product Improvements, that's all on you. I always leave those blank myself because it's going to check all of them by themselves and then you have to uncheck them. And if that's if you don't want them on, see here, hmm. Well, I think if you agree to all or proceed, okay. Do not agree to all if you're not going to agree to all of these. Um, smart TV services is the, is the smart services they have. Basically, it uh, sees what program you're watching and it recommends programs for you uh, with the program recommendations as well and the product improvements is basically them looking at your TV when you're using it sometimes and seeing how they can improve upon the product and we all know after the Z9F is about a couple years old now it's not going to be they're not going to be looking at improving the product anymore they're going to be moving forward with different TVs so you could decide on that and uh, what I'm going to do here is just take a look at the uh, TV here and uh, put a disc in see if there's anything that's been different that I noticed okay and just doing a quick quick look at everything right now um, it looks like there's no difference in picture quality at all I didn't, wasn't expecting to have any picture quality difference to begin with Sony's very good at their updates um, ever since I've had a Sony I switched from Samsung to Sony TVs I've never had a problem with any of the updates so knock on wood but um, they've usually have done a really, really good job on the updates. No problems at all. Now, um, I also looked at the, uh, the actual screen itself. And if I pull it up in the settings, it's exactly the same as the update I did when I put the 950H Z9G update on the TV as well. It's the exact same format as I figured it would be. It's just basically delayed for the Z9F compared to the other TVs because the other TVs are newer and they want to make it seem like they're newer. So this update is pretty much optimized for the Z9F now. It's basically the 950H and the Z9G update, but now it's optimized for the Z9F. Probably stuff we don't know about. I saw in the, the, um, in the uh, actual description, it looks like they did something to the Wi-Fi a little bit. And they improve some of the mic capabilities of uh, receiving your voice and some small things. But other than that, of actually getting this update as far as, you know, the look of it and everything, it's exactly the same as what I've seen before. So with that said, please like and subscribe. Um, and also, I do have a Patreon. Those of you who feel generous of giving on this holiday, uh, you could put a little something, something in my Patreon. It's not required, of course. And... Uh, Take care. Have a good Christmas.